Hi there, this is Torsten Kunert. I'm a natural practitioner based in Santa Monica, California, and um, I'm reporting directly from Limo Well. So these are natural videos on the go and information I share with you. Today we're going to be talking about athlete's foot. A lot of people suffer from athlete's foot. And let me just read an extract to you what this exactly is all about. So athlete's foot is also known as tinea pedis. It is a persistent and annoying fungal infection of the foot. It commonly occurs between the toes and the toenails, but it can also occur on other areas of the foot. So not a very cool uh, disease to be uh, suffering from. It's very annoying, very itchy, very embarrassing at times. And um, we'll be discussing in length in several other videos as to what you can do about this, what foods to eat, what foods not to eat, what uh, general recommendation recommendations we make. And um, sores and blisters can form on the soles of the feet and between the toes. The infected areas may also burn or, as I mentioned, already itch. Moisture and warmth provide an environment for this fungus to thrive. Public or private showers, locker rooms, gym floors and hotel bathrooms are common places for a person to contract the fungus. People with sweaty feet are more susceptible to getting athlete's foot and some have a natural resistance to athlete's foot while others must be more careful with their general hygiene. Changing into clean socks reduces the risk of reinfection and um, we also find that in many cases of chronic athlete's foot, there is an underlying systematic problem with candidiasis, candida basically. For more effective therapy in these cases, it is important to have a systematic treatment to eradicate the fungus. Um, most cases of athlete's foot can be treated at home. However, complications can arise when a bacterial infection sets in along with the existing fungal infection. If your athlete's foot does not improve with natural treatment or if it gets worse, see a doctor for a re-evaluation. For an evaluation, sorry. Um, if you need to uh, watch other videos uh, about athlete's foot, um, I make recommendations on foods to eat, foods not to eat, and some really good uh, natural prescriptions that um, get rid of it. Thank you and see you at limowell.com.